what is going on guys it is your boy Rafi, and we are back with more house of the dragon i'm not gonna lie i only see this episode going like one or two ways because now that the king is dead queen allison is probably gonna take out aemon's other eye when she finds out uh like you know about when he burns his ass or they don't really care and just move on but yeah i'm really excited to get into this so without further ado episode five let's get it All my thoughts about what was gonna happen in this episode with the king, I completely forgot about Princess Renice. Oh, Behold! Man. The traitor dragon Melis! Slain at Brook's rest by your king! We're really parading a dragon head. Mark my words, this is a black omen. Look at them. They don't even look, you know, happy about it. I mean, I guess from what that guy said, this is a black omen. Because they view them as gods, right? The dragons? The traitor dragon may lease. I thought the dragons was gods. Oh, right. Okay, see? It's just me. you say it's just meat bro <sighs> these mother lovers are still up what the hell is going on <sighs> i mean how long has it been is that the king is that what we're carrying his ass in i mean for king i thought there would be like some gold wrapped but I mean, I guess, why would we need that if that man is dead already? I mean, that's a wild statement. He's, he is a king. So, y'all fucked up. Oh, this, it's not even the king. It's just his... Okay, never mind. It is the king. I thought it was just his equipment. Is he alive? His grace remains with us for the moment what out of all things I, I i thought that fall would have killed him for sure oh no dude his fucking armor melted onto his skin oh my god he looks like he's almost a cooked tilapia. If you'll excuse me, Your Grace, these next hours are most critical. <laughs> I mean, just the fact that he's alive. Bro. <laughs> what happened? We took the castle at the cost of some 900 men. So she doesn't know yet. So I've heard. Okay. Okay, I'm gone. The king. His grace fought valiantly. And Aemond? What was his part in this? I could not say. For real. We're not gonna tell her that her son felled the king. Kristen Cole marches about the crown lands unchallenged. We still have no ground army, but the one we hope that Damon will raise. He who has left us after some marital spat. Do you take issue with me, Sir Alfred? <sighs> my loyalty to you is proven, my queen. It is merely that the gentler sex has not been much privy to the strategies of battle. There has been peace in our lifetime. You've seen no more battles than I have. <laughs> Shit. This small council is in disarray. It's all messed up. We stressed out. Someone get Damon, bro. By the way, that wasn't fire. That was me slapping my thigh. If Aegon is dead, we will soon know it. The time is ripe. 
If we can strike King's Landing before that dragon is recovered... Then I myself must do it. My queen, you are the crown. It's out of the question. What would you have me do? Stay back. And send your men out with plans. But then again, I don't have a plan, so... I'm currently in the same position as, as you. Dude, this shit is insane. I'm not gonna lie. I'm loving this. Jace? Where are you going? To Harren Hall. To treat with the Daemon. Rhaenys is fallen. He must affirm his loyalty to my mother and report his standing. Okay, okay, I'm with it. And you think you will tame him? When the Queen herself could not? I can sit still no longer. I must act. The Freys. They control the crossing at the Twins. Craig and Stark's Greybeards are marching south. If his men had a direct route into the Riverlands, we would not have to wait for Damon to act. Okay. She will not like it. Then don't tell her. Not until I'm away. Bro, if you die. <laughs> the hour is late. My dragon is hungry. Our terms are simple, Lord Bracken. Bend the knee to me. Or your house burns. We choose fire. Oh, no way. Y'all really chose death. I did not think they would be so eager to die. Oh, no, bro. They made their choice. They would rather burn than succumb. Exactly the kind of men I need. It may yet be possible, I, I mean, think, yeah, for us to achieve our ends. You could try less fighting and more... persuading. You take my meaning, then. What? Show them your worst. I am your servant, your grace. So we're gonna send him off into a side quest so we can lure the Bracken in with women? Is, is that what we're doing? Many and more armies have broken themselves against my bloody gate. Are you listening? My lady. The Eyrie itself is impregnable. Unless, of course, we're descended upon from the sky. You promised the Queen Rhaenyra 15,000 swords. In return for a dragon. Then she has exceeded your terms. <laughs> she sent two. Four? Oh, shit. I can't count, I guess. <laughs> I have hunting hounds that are more fearsome. I do not recall you specifying the size of the beast in your request. Will you goad me, child? When your bread and shelter now depend on my pleasure. Shit. The dragons will grow. I don't have time. I mislike feeling powerless. I mean... So do I. You said this is impregnable. We... All we have is time. I mean, technically, we... That's all. Never mind. We're at war, and... They also have dragons. The way they spoke at my small council today. Oh, they would make me queen, but they wish to keep me here, confined. You are your father's chosen successor. They did not prepare me to fight. Instead, I was given my father's cup, taught the name of every lord and castle between Storm's End and the Twins, but not the difference between Hilt and Foible. And they but know it. Knowledge is key. And Damon as well. Shall your evening meal be served here, Your Grace? Not now. <laughs> You really came to interrupt for that. I mean, I guess she's just doing her job, so. Kristen Cole made a mistake. Parading a dragon's head through the streets like a prize of war. But the people see an ill omen. Yes, it's true. Right. They are afraid. And you think they will turn to me? To the discontented, rumors are feed. Rumors are feet. Your grace. That's what you cannot crazy. do, let others do for you. 
so what are we doing? Are we going to start a rumor in King's Landing? I assume this is where this lady is off to. Because she was fucking devastated. That seems like a tough mission. If someone recognizes her, you know? The thought of her lying in a field, broken amongst her enemies. She was fierce. In love and in anger. And with her gone, I must rely on you, I think. Your grace? Would you give this to your grandsire? Damon. You were always the strong one. Are, the are finest we, swordsman. Are we cheating on Rhaenyra right now? Viserys was unsuited for the crown. But you, <gasps> Damon, you were made to wear it. Oh my god. Damn, you slut. <laughs> what the hell is going on here? Oh, yo, you better stop before I tell Rhaenyra. Oh no, did we just kill if this I lady? been born first. My favorite son. You just did you just have sex with your mother in, a goose in you prefer. what the fuck what the fuck just happened? I like the goose myself. <laughs> Dude, this is strange as hell, bro. How does the work here progress? Oh, um the roof alone has needed tending since the reign of my niece and the storerooms and the Wailing Tower. The Wailing Tower. Is that another phrase for brothel? Um, there is, of course, the matter of payment. Is there any gold left in your coffers? Enough to keep this small establishment you see fed and warm. Relatively. I... I rather thought your grace as... Emissary to the Queen. Harold is my command. I shall guarantee the payment myself. So it's for sure he's Very well, your grace. Running against like Rhaenyra, he's going for the throne prince. on his own. What would you call the husband of the Queen? Oh, the King. There it is then. Consort. That last bit seems unnecessary, don't you think? I mean, whatever you say, was you are a slut. <laughs> I mean, I only call you that because you ate out your mama <laughs> in thought. Has he woken? I must admit, I'm not sure he will ever wake. I have plied my crafts to their fullest extents. <laughs> Our king's fate lies with the gods now. A king cannot rule in his sleep. So they're just the realm will have noticed his absence. Play it off like Maylis was the one that burned his ass alive. But now we must name a regent to take his place until he recovers. Did you have a candidate in mind, Your Grace? I myself served in this role for my husband. I am well prepared to do it again. The king does not lack for heirs. The obvious choice, Prince Aemon. Agreed. Aemon is a fearsome dragon rider. His skill is best employed in the field, but my experience is needed here, at this table. No offence was meant, Your Grace, but at a time... Lord Laris. I agree, Your Grace. It must be Prince Aemon. But, um... Aemon is the next in line. It must be him. <sighs> After knowing... It's exactly agreed, what happened on, on the field. Bruh, that's crazy. <laughs> what is our standing in the Riverlands? In disarray, your grace. You're in disarray. And just like that, she feels exactly how Aegon felt, right? The way she's looking at Aemon, she has to have an inkling, right? Bro, blink. <laughs> this shit is crazy. 
The city's safe no longer. We must get out. And where would you have us go? For all we know, every road leads into the dragon's teeth. Like the one they carted through the streets. You think Rhaenyra will let such an affront go unchallenged? By all means, stay and wait for his empty promises, husband. With them, you can feed the mouths of ghosts. So that's it. There you go. Bro, the dog has been chilling, waiting. Dude, that is some shit. <laughs> that's it. They're down. A blacksmith, right? I assume the best blacksmith he be because he's the only one being shown. Seeing faithfully to the Prince Regent's commands. Aemond is the next in line. You know what he is. What he has somehow become. Has your loyalty faded or does it flourish only at night and flee the sunrise like a moth? <sighs> what I saw at Rook's Rest. What? Their armor melted. There were men walking, they were on fire. Oh man. As sad as that is, I thought you were gonna talk about Amin's actions. So you cast me aside? Have I not spared you? What we must do now is terrible. Is this who you are, Alison? I did not ask to be spared. I did not give you leave to speak my name. Hmm. And that's it. No more nighttime gilly gagging for you guys. G gilly wagging? Get get it back? No more nighttime fucking for y'all. By order of Aemon Targaryen, return to your homes! You want me? Our Lord Grover Tully has not declared for Rhaenyra. Jason Lannister is marshalling to the west. We need to check him before he reaches River Run. That requires passage. Do you offer us your protection? I do. And the protection of my uncle. And Damon, did, did you really have I'm sure, has consented to this? Damon into this? He will do as his queen commands. That does lend us some comfort. <laughs> Though it occurs to me that dragons cannot be in two places at once. Honestly, or it looked three. like they were going to give in just with your protection. Now you put Damon what do you into want? this? Laris Strong has been relieved of his castle. Does the Queen intend to raise up a new lord? They want Harrenhal. You want Harrenhal? No way. I mean, in the Game of Thrones, it's still a shithole, is it not? That, so they never end up taking it. My mother will want more than your crossing. What does her grace desire? Bent knees. Okay, so was that a yes? Wait, are we rebuilding here and home? Oh, okay. I hear strange things from Brackenland, from Stonehenge, and Lambswold, and Moray. There's news then? No. What I hear, I hear in the wind. War is a terrible thing. This is not war. These are crimes against the innocent. <laughs> is that the kind of army you would raise? We serve you under duress. Well, once they agree to serve me, I'll treat them fairly. And once again, in the name of power, it's the weak and the women who must endure. The realm will suffer if fame and one eye rules. I'd heard the same thing about you. But I'll cross you no further. I'm sure your tactics are, after all, approved by the Queen. The people who support her will not be led by her. They look to a man for strength. When I take King's Landing, Rhaenyra is welcome to join me there and take her place by my side. Oh, King no and Queen. way. Ruined no together. way. 
And if you lose, Saul's right. then I'll be dead. And none of this will be my problem. It's a pity, don't you think, that you never knew your mother? Oh, don't you talk about his mother like that. <laughs> he knew her in ways most children don't. <laughs> Uh, fresh news from Stonehenge. House Bracken is yours. Call Sir William here no, no so the time I congratulate him. The Blackwoods will be fetid in these halls. What exactly did he do though? My castle is a tomb. I am sad to have missed its highest days. I imagine your Hall of Nine filled with lords and kings. The wealth he brought back from E.T. and a shy, inspiring awe and envy. I wonder if any of them knew it was all for her. Damn. Queen Rhaenyra wishes to name you Hand. No way. <laughs> I should not ask enough of my house. Pledge your peace to King's Landing then. They will accept it most gleefully. Bruh. Rather, I would sail into the west and be lost. Renice was not only your wife. Not a thing to be taken from you. She was a Targaryen princess. And she died. She died as she would have wished to die. The way my mother chose. And the way I myself wished to meet my end. Oh, bruh. Oh, bruh. You yourself may do as you see fit. Bro. Granddaughter. I love this conversation. That was such good dialogue. I would make you my heir. I am blood and fire. Driftmark must pass to salt and sea. <laughs> oh my god, I just got chills. This... Does she know about Alan? Bro, dude, that gave me chills. Oh my god, that was nipple hardening content. You were correct in saying our best hope of an army is with Damon. I wish you to go to Harrenhal. Are you removing me from your council? Are we. Re it's Alfred. I, I will not deny you have had my patience of late, but you and your house served my father well. We cannot challenge King's Landing without the Riverlands. I ask you to. Oh, man, I... Reason with him. Find out his state of mind and his intentions. Dude, I don't like how this is going to go because he's obviously... Whether he means to raise a host gonna for me or for to his side, right? Go now with haste. I'll send good men to see to your safety. Your Grace. What is it, Sir Simon? Is the pudding now served? <laughs> see, I must begin here with a lesson in etiquette. House Bracken have been brought to heel at the hands of William Blackwood. There have been um, complications. The sacred seps on Bracken lands were looted and burned. As were the fields and farms. The livestock was stolen, and our peasants put to the sword. They pursued the women and the children. The oh, shit. Them. So that's what the girl was talking about. What I hear, I hear in the wind. So that's what the guy did to get them to be persuaded. A terrible war is being fought in these lands. Have you looked after our girls? Know this, interloper. Dragon or no, we shall not raise our banners for a tyrant. Hmm. And just like that, we no longer have the Brackens. Bruh. What are we doing? Okay. We're back with the rumor lady. Move along, lass. I have an errand for the Lady Masaria. 
I thought she was dead. Would she die without collecting her due? That guy who works with Lady Missaria? Cool! Fuck. She's taking the job. <sighs> okay, I'm with this. Was it worth the price? Bro, that's... Dude, so is he gonna end up marrying his sister for for duty's sake <laughs> I mean didn't he say that when he was younger in like the first season that he would marry his sister for duty dude his 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 eyes were open did, did he just say mommy bruh She's always leaving at the wrong time. Like, look at look at what happened with King Viserys. Prince Viserys, your grace. <sighs> okay. Shit. God, <laughs> that look was crazy. Visenya. I hope you do not mean to use her as an example. Why shouldn't I? Oh, it was a long time ago. Why do you look angry? You chafed at being prevented from action. Imagine, my lord, I'm a dragon rider as well. With a war being fought over my ascension. And yet, I must wait here. Always prudent. Oh, okay. Sending others to fight and be felled in my name. You are the queen. The tie that binds us. No harm can come to you. And you are my son, and I did not give you leave to go. You do not give me leave to go to anything. And when Aemond comes hunting for you, will you fly before Vega as Luke did? I have done all I can from here. Sent my messages, invoked my alliances. But if all else fails, it is I who must fight. You have two large enough to stand against Vega. They are called Vermithor and Silverwing. Yes, and if only they had riders, none could stand against me. There are those of our line who never ruled. Those who married into other noble houses. Blood would be thin. And yet? Are you suggesting we put a malister on a dragon? A malice. A tarly. It's better than death and defeat. Tarly. Like... Like Samuel Tarly? There are records here. We were related to... Wait, John and... John and Samuel Tarly there could were be scores of them. related this whole time. It's a mad thought. Wait, is that so? Is that how the Tarly family ends up with a Valyrian sword that we have to steal at some point? Oh shit! Okay, nah, dude, this is cool. This is really cool. Oh man, dude, what an episode. I'm honestly nervous for the guy that Queen Rhaenyra sent off to Harrenhal because like, bro, he wants a male leader, right? And then Daemon is building up his army so he can take King's Landing. It's gonna be interesting because I see him turning his back on Rhaenyra. But that ending though, can someone let me know if Samuel, Tarly, and Jon Snow are actually related? Because dude, that would be so dope just them being best friends and not knowing they're like i guess cousins hey that's a that's a that's a big reveal but anyways that has been my reaction to episode five of house of the dragon season two episode five i'm gonna be hopping into the next episode so uh if you guys enjoyed please leave a like comment subscribe do whatever you want to do and uh, until next time i'll see you guys later peace out